Hi, welcome to the Reclaim Me channel and today we talk about Zen Recovery. Zen is software uh, used to virtualize hardware. Typically, Zen is used by hosting providers and small data centers. Uh, in order for virtual machines to function, Zen should store uh, disk images of virtual machines. Now let's discuss how data storage is organized in Xen uh, servers. Uh, there is no Xen file system as such, that is, Xen servers uh, can operate with either any block devices, for example, with partitions on the disks or with a host file system. Uh, to store uh, disk images of virtual machines, uh, Zen uses uh, VHD format. There are two ways to store VHD files. Uh, the first way is typical files inside the host file system, uh, typically XT file system. Uh, let's illustrate. At the first level, we have a hardware RAID, say a hardware RAID 5, the capacity of which is allocated for then boot partition and for a partition holding a host file system, typically EXT file system. VHD files are stored inside this host file system. Let it be three VHD files. A VHD file 1, VHD file 2 and VHD file 3. In real life, you will have dozens of them. Another way is when a VHD file is written directly uh, to a partition. Uh, theoretically, almost uh, any partitioning scheme can be used. However, in practice, this is um, uh, typically LVM allowing to um, extend a partition dynamically, thus providing thin uh, provisioning. Let's illustrate. Uh, similar to the previous case, at the top level we have a hardware rate. Uh, for example, a hardware RAID 5. Uh, then we have a partition holding Xen boot data. Uh, at the next level, there is LVM metadata. Storing pointers to the multiple LVM volumes. LVM volume 1 and LVM volume 2. In real life, you will have much more LVM volumes. Each LVM volume is used to store a particular VHD file. That is, LVM volume 1 is used to store only the content of VHD file 1. LVM 2 is used for VHD file 2. Typically, you have a Zen server uh, using enterprise-level storage, uh, which is known to be used along with Linux or a Zen uh, virtualization platform, for example, from Citrix. Now let's discuss what approaches are used uh, to recover data from Zen servers. No matter what scheme is implemented, 
uh, you need to understand that finally you need to get VHD files uh, which uh, in the first case are stored uh, in the host file system while in another case VHD files are stored uh, directly in the partitions if a Zen server uses LVM volumes to store user data that is host file system is not involved to store VHD, to recover data you should connect all the disks to a PC and if needed reconstruct a RAID first. Check that LVM partitioning scheme is enabled for analysis. Then have Reclaim Pro scan the disks including reconstructed RAID. Select each needed LVM volume one by one and make raw images of them. Since partitions already store data in VHD format, you do not need to create VHD files again. By the way, you can verify that you deal with VHD by checking first and last sector of the partition, which both should start with a string connectix. Rename the created images by adding a VHD extension to them. Mount disk image files one by one in disk management. Sometimes when mounting a VHD in Windows, you can get an error saying that VHD image is corrupt and therefore cannot be mounted. It can be due to the differences between VHD formats used in Windows and in Xen. Uh, in this case, you can use Gizmo drive software to mount the recovered VHD files. The alternative option is to import uh, the recovered VHD files uh, into a new Xen installation. Uh, the second case is when a host uh, file system is used to store VHD files. As well as in the previous case, first you need connect disks to a PC and if needed reconstruct a RAID first. Uh, then you need to have Reclaim Pro scan all the disks including a reconstructed RAID. Uh, then you need to identify uh, the partition containing a host file system and uh, scan it. As I have already mentioned, uh, typically this is EXT file system. And finally you need to copy uh, VHD files in the same way you do with any other files. Once uh, VHD files are extracted, you need uh, to mount uh, them in Windows or, uh, or import them into a new Zen installation. Uh, that's all about Zen recovery. If you like our videos, subscribe to the Reclaimy channel. Reclaimy team was with you. See you soon.